Hi, Hiram here. Uh, I'm going to repeat a test that I did the other day with this intense outdoor gear all-in-one stove. It's the one where I took the canister and I spread the wick out to see if that would bring the pot of water to boil quicker. What had happened was the uh, can was like going on its last leg, so the test was kind of flawed. So I have it, the can that I got from Intense Outdoor Gear. I spread the wick around. Let me light this. Okay, you can see it burning there. Put the all-in-one stove on. I have two cups of water here setting at 60 degrees. And let's see where this goes. Okay, we're now seven minutes into the test, into the burn test. I think you can see that the flames are pretty wide. Uh, pretty much edge to edge of the threaded area. But we're seven minutes in and the temperature is up to 122 degrees. Still not exactly a you know, speed demon. There we have 212 and 2233. Oh, that was a little disappointing. Okay, so that was two cups of water starting at 60 degrees. Came to a boil in 22 minutes, 33 seconds. That wasn't as good as the last test that I did where I had a partially full can. Hmm, don't know why that's doing that. I guess just all the way around, the uh, all-in-one stove, you know, good stove with that. But the fancy heat is just not that hot of a fuel. Uh, I should have said uh, that was with the Argo Titanium cup. Room temperature is 54 degrees, humidity 47. It's dark out, but it was cloudy and breezy the last time I looked. That was two cups of water starting at 60 degrees. Came to a boil in 22 minutes, 33 seconds. I don't know. So I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.